Hey everyone, I'm Dark Quoter and welcome back to The Wolf Among Us. So I actually played this, played the beginning of episode 2 already, but somehow the video didn't record, so I have to do it again. Unfortunately. Well, fortunately for you guys, I guess, since you actually get to uh, see it this time. But, unfortunately for me, because that was a lot of time just kind of wasted. But, anyway. Here's a recap of episode one. Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid c- You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. I'm a little annoyed. No. Don't mind me. I'm not lying for someone when I don't know the reason. Sorry. It's not what you might be thinking. What am I thinking? Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Yeah, I did. Come with me. So, yeah, they found Faith. Dead. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. No, I did. And then at the end of the episode, Snow White died. Yeah, it was dear dumb that broke into Toad's apartment. Well, he's not here. Holly, you're out of paper towels and the, they're gonna string me up, baby. You said it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad. Yeah. I didn't do it. All right. I got a hundred. Yeah, that kind of makes me think he didn't actually do it. About a girl name. Fuck, man. I mean, I don't know, but. I mean, it's probably more complicated than that. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. I should try to read the fables books at some point. I'm sure they're pretty good. I've heard they're good. And here we see Snow White dead. Is really weird. You're making this more difficult than it has to be. Am I? If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? I know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. I'm feeling pretty fucking pissed off right now, if I'm honest. To smash everything in this room. Is that a threat? Depends on how much you like the furniture. I didn't think that was funny, in case you were waiting for me to laugh. I thought it was funny. Look, I know what you must be going through. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. You know, I hate to say it, but I don't think you do. Of course. You're... you're right. I can't imagine what you're going through right now. Then why'd you say you did? What is it with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? Didn't think so. Yeah. You 
Your nose is bleeding. You missed a spot. You, uh, you just smeared it across your face. You got a tissue or something? Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah, I know. I just said that. Is there something? Hear what? Please. Please. <laughs> Lady, you're going crazy. I'm sorry. Just make it stop, please. Uh, yeah, I think I'm out of here. I'm gonna go. Think about my go friend. Now. Um, what the fuck is going on? You should be thanking me. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours and everything they saw at the woodlands. Well, hurry up. That would be nice. You better take the picture, though, buddy. You don't want to leave evidence, do you? Should actually probably take her forms and notes and stuff. She's gonna wake up and say, Why did I write this? I better go investigate this guy. That. We, um, I hope so. Found Tweedledee chained up to a post. It was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. Dee was at the trip trap when Snow was left at the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. Bluebeard's currently interrogating him, and he hasn't said anything useful. He's working for somebody. Whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. Right, but they're still suspicious. They're still of interest, wouldn't you agree? I know what you're thinking, Bigby. Do you? It's been one full night and a slice of morning, and I already miss her too. Actually, I was thinking about tacos, but okay. So simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. But ever since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. You don't like New York? Did she um, give any indication to what she was thinking? When you saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was. She could come off as callous sometimes, but she wasn't. She said that she wanted to change things, make it easier for Fables to get help when they need it. Yeah. I don't know what else to say, Bigby. We have to have to put an end to this. I'm trying. It's been two murders in as many days. If we don't unearth our culprit, and soon there will likely be another on our doorstep tonight. I'll get it done. Please, Bigby. For Miss White. I got it. Dude, I said I was gonna do it. I said I was gonna get it done.
I'm going to the basement. That's not a very good answer, is it? Come on, just tell me what I want to know. It will make things a lot less painful for you, in theory. Oh, were you planning on using that? I just thought you really liked rubbing your little sword. Well, he does, what but that's besides do you think the point. You're doing? Hello, Ichabod. Sheriff. Bluebeard. I was just chatting with our new friend. You were supposed to wait for us to get back. I told you, if you want to be involved, you will do things my way. Yeah. No violence. Whatever you say, Ichabod. Hello, Big B. I want answers, D. Oh, goody. I thought you wanted questions, and I was having so much trouble thinking of any good ones. Though I'd settled on, how's your head? You see what I've been dealing with? What are you going to do about this, Bigby? I'm glad you have a sense of humor. I hope that means you're willing to cooperate. Snow White is dead. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. You were with me when it happened, dummy. I still have questions for you, D. Sounds like a personal problem. This is ridiculous. You know I saw you at Faith's apartment. What were you doing there? Girls got air conditioning. You can't imagine what it's like living in a little shithole with no air. Especially with this heat I do. going on. I'm not fucking around here, D. Alright, D. Let's get to know each other. I know what it's like to not have air. We don't have air conditioning right now, and it's really hot here, which kind of sucks. Fuck, Big B. Don't make me look at that. Just put that away. Please. If you don't tell me who did this, I'll make sure you end up the same way. Dead on your doorstep. Got it. I told you, I didn't kill her, and I don't know who did. Just tell me what you were doing at Faith's apartment. Look, Big B, we're not on opposite sides here. My brother and I are trying to get to the bottom of things. Same as you. Your brother? Where was he last night? I can't say. He could have been anywhere. Take your best guess. He's been killing somebody. He didn't do it, if that's what you're thinking. Then where is he? No, I'm not sending you after my brother. Look, I answered your question. Can I get my stuff back now? What did you find on him? Oh, uh, nothing of consequence, really. Nothing of consequence. I'll be the judge of that. Myron. I'm saving that. This is really. What's the point of this? Here. Oh, Bluebeard doesn't like yeah, that. All right. Want to see a trick? your brother look mate I'd like to help I would but I can't tell you where he is last time I saw him, we split up and I went to find faith I don't know where he is now you mentioned faith look I went to her apartment that's no secret you saw me no there's more to it you said you were trying to find something all right D since you never answered my first question what did you want from faith Sorry, I can't help you. I'm not saying any more about it. That's all I have to say about that. You always carry this much cash. I've got a lot of laundry to do this week. What's it to you? I'm declaring a tax on uncooperative troublemakers. You taking out a loan? You might not like the interest on that. 
You'll need to account for that. You can't just... There are procedures to be followed. We'll talk about it later. Dude, let me handle this. What did you want from Faith? Sweet girl like her. Sweet? You think that girl was sweet? She was a fucking thief. Fucking sweet. Faith was plenty of things, but that ain't one of them. You still seem pretty mad about it. Hell, I ain't bothered. Wasn't me she stole from. Nah, she took something from my boss. Your boss? You sounded pretty so angry. Let's talk about your boss then. You're gonna get me in trouble, Big B. I can't answer any more of your questions. Really? You just carry this around? Always handy that way. I couldn't hurt, I guess. Why don't you just tell me who you're working for? Look, you're not a bad guy, despite what beauty says about you. At least you're not a total bastard anyway. But I just can't give you that information. There's no way beauty would associate with a scumbag like you. What's wrong with me? You're telling me I ain't pretty enough? Yeah, we're real close. I thought this was supposed to be a murder investigation, but you're treating this guy like a fucking house guest, Bluebeard! And not getting any answers from him this way. Snow White is dead. One of us. And you're going to let this ignorant shit walk out of here in one piece. Out of my way. I'll show you how it's done! <laughs> What the fuck? What do you think you're doing? Teaching him a lesson. Now pay attention. Stop this right now! You enjoying yourself? Stop! What the fuck Seems do you think be. you're doing? Yeah, this caught me by surprise last time, but I'm ready now. Snow White, who is apparently not dead. Snow. That's a little odd. What happened to her, right? Why is she not dead and who's actually dead? Nobody knows. This is pretty interesting so far. I'd actually like to go and read the books if I could. Can't afford to do that right now. But I think that would be pretty interesting. Is this security guard guy? He's always asleep. Is he a... supposed to be sleepy? On down there, Big B? Abusing a prisoner like that. I didn't lay a hand on her. I wanted to do things the right way, but Bluebeard had other ideas. I tried to stop him, Snow. Yeah. Okay, you, you're gonna have to explain this because I'm really not getting it yet. Yeah. After a conversation in the taxi last night, I got a call from Toad. He said his son found the body. We thought it was Faith at the time. Getting her back here wasn't easy. But hopefully we'll find something on her to help us track down the killer. Or at least to figure out who she is. I'm glad you took care of things. She'll remember that. Thanks. Hopefully, since I just told her. Snow? What is it? I'm glad you're not 
I'm dead. Me too. I just want to get to the bottom of this. She will remember that. I just feel like... What is it? I just... I feel responsible in a way. She looked just like me. And maybe that's why she was killed. Snow, it's not your fault. But she looked just like me. That can't be a coincidence. Probably not. I just have to find out who did this. And why she was glamoured to look like me. I mean, that's what it is, right? So, Unless you have a twin sister. That's our next move. I'll figure this out. Don't worry. And what am I supposed to do? Sit around the business office twiddling my thumbs? Waiting for the big bad wolf to solve all my problems? I'm the Sheriff Snow. I go out and do the dirty work to keep you all safe. And what am I here for then? I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. I just want you to be careful. You're an administrator. I almost lost you once. I'm and... not yours to lose. I'm sorry. I know it's dangerous, but I'm not helpless. I can take care of myself. Been doing it for centuries. TJ is waiting inside. He was so freaked out last night, he wouldn't tell us much. Even now, he just stops talking altogether after a certain point. He's pretty shaken up, though, so try not to be too, you know. Myself. Right. All right, I'll try. No promises, though. TJ's over there. I don't know if you want to talk to him first or after, but let me know when you're ready to see the body. I... I want to be there. Buffkin, do you have a second? Of course, Miss Snow. All right, so let's investigate the area. Mm, let's look at the lamp. Of course, there's no genie. So what else? Tarot cards. Is this supposed to give me a these can't solve murders. Is this supposed to give me a preview of what's to come? Well, that's appropriate. A heart with three swords in it. I don't know what that means. The moon. Usually this is about deception or confusion. But for me, well, who knows? Yeah, I'm deceived and confused. So it's working. I hope you can find what you're looking for. The Hermit. I have no idea what the Hermit is supposed to mean. Acids. Maybe this has been harder Can anybody in I the thought. comments tell me what these cards are supposed to tell me? Because I have no idea. I don't know anything about tarot cards or... You know, what they're supposed to mean. Anything like that. Snow's perfume. Okay, so that's either Doomfist's fist or, I don't know, the Infinity Gauntlet, maybe? I have no idea. But let's talk to Toad and TJ. Oh, that's enough. Uh, Mira, vanish! Cancel! What the hell are you doing? What are they what? doing? I wasn't touching nothing. What's going on? Don't worry, no harm done. What were you doing with the mirror, Toad? I thought maybe I'll catch you on the shitter. I was just having a laugh. We've been waiting there a long time. TJ. It's all right. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? It's okay. 
This won't take long. Go ahead, TJ. I go swimming at night sometimes. In the river. I wasn't doing anything bad. I promise. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You're not in trouble. Just tell me what happened. I was there, under the big blocks, and I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. That's right, son. Then I saw... I... I saw the lady. <laughs> the lady? It's okay, son. Take your time. The lady... fell in. But... but she didn't have her head on. I thought... I thought she was gonna pull me down, too. How? Because she had rocks on her feet and she kept falling down in the dark parts. <laughs> in the river? Cinder blocks tied to her ankles. Is there more, TJ? Is it true? You know when people are lying? I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. Yeah, it's my special power. I always know when people aren't telling me the truth. Is there something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I, I didn't stay under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared. And, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it. I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight or bad things can happen. I told you. You're not in trouble. Like Ellie's not. Not this time, Toad. So you didn't stay underwater? I don't know if anyone saw me, but, but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Stop. Wait, you heard someone? Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? I didn't want to be in trouble. Were those the same words they used? Stop laughing? Try to remember exactly what they said. They said... They said... Stop laughing... At me. Did you hear anyone laughing? No! Sheriff... Did you see who it was? No! Bigby, he's frightened. All right. Okay, TJ. I'm sorry. After I came up again, there was no one there. And I ran home, that's all. I promise. I want to go home. Okay, you can go. <laughs> Thank you, TJ. Okay, son. <laughs> Let's get you home. You did a good job, kid. Come on, then. Climbing time, we'll remember that. That went about as well as I expected. <sighs> you want to go look at the body now? Mm, in a minute. In a minute. Not just yet. When you're ready. I think there's a little more to look at around here. I want to go talk to the mirror. Hey, mirror. Hello, Big B. Nice to see you. What were you showing Mr. Toad and his son? Cinderella selling shoes, Rapunzel, Rose, and of course there's you. And I can't help note that you did not rhyme. Do try to stick to the rules next time. Yeah, I'll do that. Sure. The woodsman and I were fighting. Now I want to know 
where he's hiding. Well, that's helpful. Okay. It's actually not. Where can I find Tweedle Dung? Uh, and that piece of scum. He's in a car. Okay. Um, very helpful. Thank you, Mirror. Yes, there's nothing else to ask. It, I guess. Nothing. Oh, wait. Something I can see over here. I guess a book's still open. I meant what I said, Snow. Seems like not much has changed between me and Woody. Yeah. Beast, always putting on a show for each other. Let's see, I will get to the bottom of this. Donkey skin girl. That's still a weird name. Alright, well, I think this is a good time to stop for now, so uh, keep investigating next time. Well, thank you guys for watching, thanks for being cool, and I'll see you next time.